Welcome to the top 25 games of the decade presented by Machinima.com. Now, we're not telling you that these are the best games of the entire decade. We are saying that these are our favorite 25 games that have been released in the past 10 years. We left off at number 19, so let's get back into it. Gears of War, number 19. Gears of War may not have been the first third-person cover-based shooter, but it certainly popularized them. In fact, it's almost impossible to talk about the genre without mentioning Gears. But that's not all it brought to the table. The storyline of Marcus Phoenix and the team of Delta Squad defending their planet from the invading race of aliens known as the Locusts is one of the few this decade that really stuck with us. Oh, and I mean, the multiplayer was pretty good too. Coming in at number 18 is Fable. Sure, I mean, maybe Peter Molyneux's promises have become a bit of an inside joke among the video game industry, but there's a reason why we still listen to what he has to say. 2004's Fable reminded us of the magic of video games. It streamlined many of the elements that have come to complicate and clutter most of today's RPGs. But where Fable was most successful was in modernizing and revolutionizing the idea of a moral choice system in video games. Players had the ability to take either a good or evil path in the game. Your overall moral standing drastically changed not only your character's appearance, but how others would react to you as well. It's a system that is still influencing games today. Coming in at number 17 is Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Many games have been described as cinematic, but none have done it quite like Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Nathan Drake once again returned as the sassy and crude but lovable protagonist in search of the mythical treasure of Marco Polo. While the gameplay is remarkably improved in almost every way from the first game, it was Uncharted 2's narrative and sense of adventure that really drew us in. Easily one of the best action games that's come along in years. And seriously, I mean, who can forget that collapse in building sequence? That's gonna wrap it up for this episode of the Top 25 of the Decade. Make sure you come back next time for the next three in the countdown.